Hi guys, uh, my name is Kao Tony and welcome to our channel once again. Uh, in today's video, I want to import uh, our DXF file or our AutoCAD file into our uh, differential GPS. So what you need first, you need uh, the file that you want to import. Let me open it in our AutoCAD. I hope you can see the, the screen right now. We are in the field so everything will be a bit hazy. So this is the file that you want to stick after importing it. So you connect your logger to the machine. Then you go to touch options, then transfer files, then the machine will appear. So from there, you have to save your project. This is our project, project 101. You have to save it as a DXF file. So you come here save it as uh, dxf 2007 i like using 2007 because most of the people yes that auto guard so i'm saving it on my desktop then from there i can close do you want to say yes no then i close from there i will locate my file this is my project as you can see right click then you copy then you navigate to where it is. Then you put you navigate to a file uh, that you remember in the logger. So these are some of the projects that I have installed here. So I will paste it here. Then I like so from there, uh, the data is now in our logger. We can now remove our logger. Then we go to we go to our high survey road. Open it like this. It will take a few minutes. Then we select the project that you want to create. In this case, sorry. In this case, we want a new project. So we'll name it project project uh, space in sheet number one <coughs> or one okay so that's our project yeah don't mind this because we will get uh, into it the next time so we go back project select the coordinate system for the project that you want to use so here we are using LO29 uh, you can configure these uh, settings if you don't have them so you go to a predefined pre or user defined then I apply these are the coordinates that we are having uh, the coordinate system that we are having then you can control points you can actually select there then you can say you move then clear everything so that we have, we can start from zero then okay from here you just say okay then you go to project settings here you get you go to external data management you select uh, then you say add then you navigate up to where that uh, file was. So I'm navigating back. Here it is project 101. Select then OK. And it will show me the DXF project. Then I will say as it is now it's added. So we can now go back. You can't see it sometimes right now because let me go to survey in detail survey. As you can see, there it is. Let me go to graph. Sorry, a graph here. There it is. That's the imported thing. But because we didn't connect our rover and our uh, and our base, you can't uh, do anything on this one because right now it's saying none. So, uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. 
make sure to watch another our next video which will be on how to connect the rover and gps to uh, rover and the base to the uh, logger bye